So, yeah. so it was a duplex. Um, what? 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 Yeah, duplex, right? No, correct. What? So, what, like two bedroom, three bedroom? What are these duplexes like? So it was a three bed, two bath on each side, uh, 1300, nice. uh, 1350 square feet uh, around each side. Uh, one Garages side had a or car park? Uh, one car garage. Okay, very cool. What, what, did, what did you get it for? Uh, uh, 285000 And I'm guessing you lived in one side and rented out the other? Correct. Yeah, I used my VA loan to actually get into the property, $8,300 out of pocket. And uh, interest rate at a 2.875. Oh, sub three. Look at you showing off, doing a little flexing. Um, so that's, that's wow, that's great. So what is a, what is a three, two rent for? I have no idea in Texas. So at that time, um, at that time, it was around a thousand. Um, oh, correction. And they're renting it for a thousand on the other side. And at that time, it was around $1,200 on each side. Okay. For, for they, a three two uh duplex side. All right. So then you 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 buy it, you move in. Uh oh, apparently there, you move there, in. Yeah. Yeah, there's you, a story you, behind that one. Go ahead, yeah, just share share thing. with the audience. Yeah. So at, at that time again, my wife was six months pregnant and um we were supposed to move into the property in October. And the you know, essentially the time went on is about a month before October came around. Uh, the, the the lady called the agent and she's like, hey, um, I can't go home just yet. We're trying to still close on some properties. Can I stay all the way till December? And then essentially you can move in after December, after Christmas. And my wife was due in January. Mm. And so, you know, having that conversation was uh, <laughs> yeah. interesting. 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 Yeah. And, um, but we said, okay, you know, we were trying to be flexible. We still had a, sure. we were renting at the time and we, you know, we were still fine. And so essentially we stayed all the way till December. And then on January 1st, uh, my, we moved into the duplex. And my wife gave birth on January 9th. Wow. Eight days. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's crazy. So I'm guessing you closed and she did like a, a lease back from you. I'm guessing. Uh, no, so we actually delayed the closing. Oh, you delayed like, closing. Okay. Correct. Yeah. So uh, we delayed closing all the way to essentially right after Christmas. Okay. You know, and that was, and that's nerve wracking as it is because what if something happens and she's like, I'm not going to, I'm not going to yeah. do this. I mean, we had signed paperwork, sure. Uh, sure. stuff like that, like, you know, intent and stuff. But yeah, that's nerve wracking. Like, man, I don't want this deal to go to waste. And yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. So and then after that, January 1st, we moved in. You know, credit to my in laws. They helped me move in. Uh, oh, very nice. We got the house set up, um, you know, until, you know, essentially until we had my wife gave birth. That's very cool. That's all. Family helping out. 